about it. Extra, extra, read here. Extra, extra, read all about it. Extra, extra, I am spooky. Extra, extra. Okay. We die so. We all are. Are we all about ready to head into this? What's up, you people? Here we are in another Warframe Extra. Uh, today we are going to spend the Christmas Day together, me and the rest of some of my family, because we are a very big clan. We are here with Boss Mump. Hello, Boss. How are we all? With Oneonta. Hello, Oneonta. How are you? And with Zach. Cool this Shadow 12 that already spoke when we were seeing the, the little extra episode thing. Um, I am the spooky one. And he's gonna be our leader because I don't understand nothing about the Railjack. So he, today, Zach Cool the Shadow is gonna be our leader. Um, some of the players want to change. We are going to do the Railjack today. We are going to discover a little bit more of the Railjack. Uh, we are not doing. I'm sorry, it's not this way. Uh, we are not doing the normal episodes this week. Oh, yeah, it's, it, it is that way. I'm sorry, I did four dodges and then I get mistaken. Yeah, it's over here. Yeah. So, you can change here in the observatory where I am. I don't know if you see me. I think one of you are not in my squad yet. Uh, Bossman? Yeah, I think so. I'm gonna invite him for my squad. I'm in the squad. Bossman, yeah. Right over here is where you can change Bossman. Yeah. Yep. Okay, so people can change their weapons and stuff. And we are going to see what the rail check is a little bit better. Because Zach here is a big pro on the railjack, he finished all the railjack. Congratulations, Zach, for that big achievement. Thank you. It was a very. You. Thank you. It was a very, very long task. Yeah, uh, I'm very happy for yeah. that. I'm gonna give you a a class of of you know, I don't know what. This martial art that I'm master. Now I think to start off, we should go through one of the low-level Earth missions. Okay. Oh, I give you all a, a warm-up session for one. Okay. I'm in your hands, man. You you are the boss. So you are guys are ready. You can come here and we go directly to the rail check. Over here you have. A little, uh, yeah, it will say dry dog, dry dog, yeah. So, this is my well jack. I think you, you nice. already see it in the episode. It's the mad lobo death machine, yeah. And down here, everyone, get a ball. It's because Just I'm look at the thing and hit more real jack. And in the stuff are all Mad Lobo. Like Mad Max, you know. In the arena are the cars of the Mad Max in the Grand Theft Auto. So I just put this ship Mad Lobo too. So, okay, let's see. Okay, we have I'm one, not... two, three, four. Okay. We are all in. So Excellent. everybody change their weapons and stuff. Let's go. We are all together. Isaac. Can I will. You, you'll be the pilot, I don't know who's gonna be the best pilot. Be okay. First things first, I'm gonna send us to the very, very first mission of okay. Earth Proxima. Okay. This will be the deposit cluster. It's the free flight? Or the, the, the first mission? The first actual mission. Oh, uh, okay. So we, we are gonna skip the free flight. Yeah, because okay. I, don't, I don't feel that teaching in free flight will be as useful cool, cool. Dude, I thought so I'm more of I've always I've always been more of a hands-on kind of guy yeah yeah 
In in plan we had it like that too, so let's go. In the free flight though, when it first was released, I was really confused. I mean like for one, it was three random people in my squad in a base railjack that had nothing, you know? And so like we were just like I don't know what the hell we were doing. We were just floating around. But All right. in our case we, we had an enemy and he killed us in the free flight. And he killed us badly. <laughs> I it's hope like, y'all enjoying the Empyrean takeoff cinematic. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Bye now. All right, I will take up the helm. Let me explain a few things. Okay. F first off, before before we before I actually start going out and taking us into the fray, we have two side turrets here in this mid or upper middle yeah. compartment. The port and starboard turret. Yeah. Two people do that, yeah. You, you got the guns. Oh. And I fixed the ship. Multiple bogeys. Man the okay. Guns. So, and then we will have two... Cr there's also... Uh, since you're probably not aware of this, I want all of you to come with me. Uh... Yeah, what do you... Oni. Oni come here. They're coming at us. That's they may, cool. but it'll be fine for a second. So up this thing, this is actually the reactor, the engine. Oh. Right down, right down here. This is called the Arcwing slingshot. It allows you to launch yourself at enemy cruise ships and penetrate the hulls if you have the proper mastery level. But you can launch yourself toward objectives with it. And how I can use rank three. But this now a big slingshot. Yeah, so cool. Slingshot engage. Yep. I'm gonna hit the starboard turret. Okay, I'm gonna see you shoot. So what do we have to do in this mission? Just kill everybody? Kill thirty fighters. Yeah, this is a and two crew. Yeah, this is a we gotta kill thirty fighters, two cruise ships. This is a very simple mission. Okay. There's no other ulterior objectives. Okay. We will also go around and loot afterward a little bit okay. to give everyone a little bit of extra resource cushion. Which and ah, here we go. Holy, that is a. You'll all notice you got an avionics, and we just got boarded. We have enemies on board. Go ahead and uh, feel free to slaughter them. Uh, we, can, we can see them. Oh. Oh, and they come always from the slingshot thing? We have a hole or no, they will come from Full another door. Uh, they, will, they will come from the cruise ship that's in front of us, for one. But where, 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 where have like they bug? come in? You know, uh, oh, oh, yeah. So with the guys that are boarding us, you'll notice this thing right here. Yeah. It literally is called a ram sled. They they puncture our ship and came out of it okay. like this. I'm just fixing something. To uh, we have a catastrophic failure. I will go ahead and repair that just so we do not capsize. Uh, I'm, I'm on it, but I don't know where it is. Oh, oh it's, it's down here. Oh, uh, that's fine. Yeah, I've got it. And I have one Th that there. one's an emergency. All right, so real quick, I'm going to demonstrate how this Arcwing slingshot works, hopefully. If you go to the... Oh, where is it at? Oh, there he is. I don't, see don't worry, uh, just prepare the ship. I'm waiting for the... Yeah, okay, well, like, I can't Go. fix, though. Yeah. No, no, you should, you should. You keep shooting. Well, like, how do I fix, like... What oh, you I don't need to... Uh, you... Uh, Oni... Yeah, Oni, he's gonna be on repair duty. Uh... What I, what I want you on is the starboard turret. Uh... And... 
and uh, kill it. What enemies you can shoot at? Now another thing I'm going to explain here is there after this mission is you'll all get in strength points, but I'm going to go into that after the mission. You know, it's pretty, screw that thing. I'm going to use a dome charge on it. I don't think my weapon of fixing stuff is oh, fuck. working anymore. No yeah, I don't have enough. Oh, oh, uh, yep, I'm noticing that. Uh oh. This ship wasn't stocked before we left. No. I don't know how to do that yet. Uh, I will explain that if we fail. Well, somebody has to fix that. Uh, yep. Okay, so I am he we'll heading. A lot of fighter shrapnel. Pilot morale destabilizing. Escape from the ship. No. What? Let me use the forge. Okay, I'm gonna escape. And we are lo we lost. We lost. Can be replaced. Okay, so I'm going to explain uh, a few things real quick. Okay. Yeah, we got before going into any mission. I thought thought this thing was fully stocked. But I, for, no, I forgot to even ask. I yeah, sorry. I forgot to ask that. No, 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 that's fine. That's fine. I forgot to ask. Like you said, you you haven't really dealt with the railjack stuff. Never, ever. So, yeah. So what we're going to do here is when we get to the dojo again, it's, that's where it's sending us automatically. I'm going to show you the proper panel here. Okay. It's not in the ship. It's outside, so, it, it's in the dry dock. Uh, let's see here. Dropping Tenno out of airlock. Oh. Okay, so... You see me over here? Yeah. I'm jumping. Yeah. This here is where you go to upgrade uh, your, or like get new blueprints. And this here over here, this console is where you, yeah. This console here is the important, one of the most important ones. Okay. This is where you will choose what goes on your railjack. And if you click on the, up at the top, you'll notice there are six tabs. Yeah. If you click the fourth one called payload, yeah. that's how you see fully stock your ship before each oh, engage. Okay, I have Revolite. It can go to 300, I think. 300, okay. And Flux Energy, 100. Yep. I, I don't have more than 100, I'm sorry. No, no, that's fine. Well, now, what you do to... Nothing. What you do is, uh, if you can, if you can add more to them, yeah. put your mouse on them, and then just hold down left click. Left, I did it with the right one, I think. But I did the Revolite. I'm 300. I, I'm okay. 45 of 300. I'm 255. Then we have 200 of Flux Energy. Um, zero munitions. I don't know why. Um, munitions are missiles. Those are important. Dome charge. We have one of four. We have one? Of four. Four, okay, good. One of four. One of four, okay. We need, but we probably don't have the resources. So now we're going to try that mission again. Okay. And I don't touch anything else. Components, armaments, nothing else. Oh, Mechanics. now you probably, you probably don't have any new components yet. Unless, oh, no. if, you, if you look over here in this other one, the blueprints should already be researched in here. Yeah, right over here, this first uh, one I showed you. Yeah. This is where you can buy some of the base uh, components. Oh, okay. The Mark III pieces are the best ones, but as you'll notice, they're pretty expensive. So what do I need? Uh, one of each? One of each things? Uh, uh, not necessarily. Okay. Okay, let me explain. You want a Mark III yeah, Sigma but... reactor, if you can make. I don't have you want I can buy the, the blueprint? Uh, no, no, no. It doesn't come out as a blueprint. Oh, okay. It, it's going to give you it as the actual thing. Okay. So I don't have nothing. 
I have 475 cubic diodes only. Okay, so you don't have enough to make a reactor yes. Mark III? No. Okay, so that probably will mean you don't have enough to make any of the Mark III no. stuff, so that's fine. No. So what we're going to do now is we're going to go into that first mission again, and this time I have a feeling we're going to stomp it. Okay. We're going to do it. Yes. Now that we've got this uh, puppy stocked, everyone get back on board of the rail jack if you're not. And and I will ship us off to the posit cluster again. Okay. And we it's a good thing we skipped the cinematic because yeah. we don't need to watch it more than once. Yeah, it's good. All right. Um, okay. So lagging. now I fix the ship. You guys shoot the same plan. So you guys can get points and you want may maybe have more experience than you. Than I. And I will fix the ship because I already know how to do it. And I will kill the enemies. The enemies come in this room, yeah? Where there is the slingshot. Uh, oh, no, 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 no. No, no, no. Uh, uh, okay, so I'll show you all the impact points they can have. They can uh, they can hit right here where I'm at currently, like the last one did. They can hit over here, and they, and they can hit down here in the back areas, like in this hall here and on the opposite side. Okay. So they only come from these four points. Okay, that's good. Yeah. Thank you, there. And now. No, it's good to know that stuff for future reference, for you, for sure. Okay, here we go. I'm gonna move us on forward. We are ready. Now that we have missiles... Oh, wait, we don't have missiles. No. Okay, it's okay. We'll get missiles after this, because I'm gonna make sure we get lots of resources. Okay, so you're not shooting everything? Yep, I am shooting everything. We got a fire suppression mod this time. Well, it's not really called a mod. In th th now, that thing that we just got, everyone's going to get one. It's called an avionic. That's one of the things you can plug into your rail jack to customize it to your fitting. Okay. But it's it's kind of like a mod for a Warframe. Okay. Now... inbound. Prepare to oh no, we have a lot of life mode. Yeah, okay. I stopped the ram sled by killing him before they could get to us. I'm here seeing watching life. Now I am gonna have to abandon ship for just a minute. I gotta go kill that cruise ship in front of us. So if, you so if you would, take the wheel, okay. and just uh, uh, fly around, oh, Do, are we taking a catastrophic failure? Yeah, uh, repair that real quick. Me? Yeah, uh, somebody. Okay, I'm gonna get it. You gotta be fixing it. You have the stuff. Yeah, can somebody grab it, please? Yeah, yeah. Okay, I'm, I'm Just keep the ship moving. I'm it. I can't pilot while it's going through this, I think. You should be able to. It's not letting me... Uh, you gotta get close to it and hit X. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's not popping up where it's okay. usually popping up. Hmm. Like, the navigation thing is, but not the pilot. Enter it. There is some odd lag going on here. Yeah, I'm like upside down, I'm like flipping around. I can't oh, I open the door on this ship. I have to fix the ship again. I'm 
I'm like really lagged now. There we go. Uh. Repair order. Seal those hull ruptures. I'm on it, I'm on it. So none of you can fly the ship? I can't Probably move not. from this turret spot. I'm like glitched as fuck and I can't unstuck. Yeah, we're having some lag issues here. I am noticing this. I can't. I'm. I don't know how to do that. I've never done that before. Okay, I'm not going to go to the fight because they are a lot and we are just one. So I'm gonna run like a coward. I, I am hide. frozen. Maybe hide. Enemy pilots are panicking. I'd Keep it up. This, but it's only well, not even camping. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. What is going on here? I just vanished. Oh my god, two holes. Oh, oh. I may need a re-invite to the mission. There we go. Oh, oh, the beat. Manager, because this is not happening. You need the station? Yeah. Incoming Just round go. sleds about to ring the doorbell. Hello deployed. Okay, let's try this again. I'm launching warframe. I don't know what that was, but it was uh Not me. Okay, they, they will. Tell me when you need to get in the section. Uh huh. I'm fixing the ship. Increasing risk of hull yep. breach. Yep. I'm trying. Seal those ruptures. I'm trying. I don't know what happened with this one try, but this was just a whole bunch of lag fest or something, yeah, some bug bugginess. I'm in Portugal. Australia, USA. Yep. Yeah, Portugal, Australia, and two USA. Yeah. Yeah, we okay, I'm, I need an invite. Okay. Coming right up. Save us, my friend. Save us. Oh, hey, dude, I'm Honey, so uh, you, you can have a glyph on your avatar, you know. I will, I will teach you that. Just a second. So people can see your glitch, not just a symbol of it. Okay, I'm back in the flight seat. Do you have the invitation? Yep, it's trying to load me, slowly but surely. Uh, that there we go. Come to the flight. And I have another process that it's off. But it does drop you. What is that? What the hell? Alert. Alert. Enemy cruise ship on scope. Okay, they Fighter come. launch detected. Okay. OE's closing in. Let them come. Zack is coming too, so we are not afraid of nothing. Okay, here we go. Looks like a party. Okay, you fly. Yeah. I'm looking for him. I'm not coming. Oh, okay. Get us out of here. Later. Repair that. Yeah, yeah. I gotta go. Uh, uh, while Oni's at the helmet, or helm, the, I'm gonna go kill those cruise ships because they have got to Hello, die. Okay. okay, you're doing good, Oni. Just keep it up. Um, leave us here alone again. Oh my god. I'm afraid. No, I'm not leaving you alone. Oh, I'm not leaving you alone. I'm just gonna. I know, I know. Only is, is flying in there, okay. Okay. Full rupture. Seal before we suffer a full blowout. Okay. Okay. Build up the welcome mat. First one. Good job. 
There's no abilities that I can use, it's kinda hard, so should I just try to go on other sides of asteroids defensively? I'd say so, just keep on the yes. other side from the bigger ships. They yeah. seem to be doing all the damage. The big ships are doing the damage, yes. Yep. And one of them is about to go boom. There, see? Scratch one cruise ship, just like Cephalon Sai said. And now I'm gonna go get the other one. We will survive this, boys! Oh, it's a fire now. What I do to a fire? I freeze them too? Damn. Where are you, damn? There's two fires now. Alright. I'm just trying to weave on the other side of this asteroid from the ship. Okay, how can I stop the fires? Uh, how do you stop fires? Okay, with the same thing. So, about those fires. Yeah. Rebel Light is used for all. Or the Omni tool is used to stop fires, electrical outages. Everything. Uh, if they freeze a door, which you'll probably not see in these low missions. It's like the. Uh, it's a w one and all repairing yeah, god. Yeah, it's the, the army knife of the driver. It can do everything. Yes, precisely. It's the Swiss <laughs> Army tool of that ship. Yeah, okay. Okay, then I can shoot this one. There we go. Our I'm last objective is burning up right now. Okay, can I shoot something? I don't think so. That's something over there. Prepare for rewards, boys. I killed something. Oh, that's really cool. Never killed something. Right. Y'all notice we got a lot of pustules and we got a lot of Kavernix as rewards there. Now is the time we all go outside here and we go about loot. So I'm gonna sh take you on a tour of that. Okay, now this. Is... No, no, no! You're not gonna use the slingshot. Uh, er stop the ship. Uh, Everyone meet in the room with all the turrets. Now there will be occasional turrets out here that we can kill, but you're gonna come over here and you're gonna exit the railjack. And you're gonna look for, uh, if you, not, yeah, blue stuff, yellow stuff, purple stuff if you see it. You're also going to kill any turrets, uh, any orange rocks. Oh, okay. uh, Everybody gets what I get. Uh, Titanium and stuff. Uh, I'm also going to, uh, have you guys, uh, show you guys points of interest that are in missions that you'll need to, uh, Familiar or surprise yourself with at lower level missions. That way you can find loot easier. Okay. So you'll, if you look out, you'll see there's these storm cloud looking thing. And also, hold on, I think I see one perfect instance. Yeah, yes. Really okay. Perfect. So there's a, there's a, you see this waypoint two I've marked. You'll notice that the space is distorted around this device. I'm, I'm really well, I'm going to... It's a destructible device, right so you'll destroy the middle middle of it here. Right from me. Yep. Oh, okay. This thing, okay. Yep, you'll destroy the middle of it, and it'll give loot like I it just collected for me. And look at that, track on. Track on. Okay. Now, we have no... Now, it's not always going to track on, uh, but... Okay. Uh, but the point is, and it's a known there. loot store. This thing over there. Uh, Can I kill this? Uh, uh, look. Uh, no, you cannot kill that. Oh, wait, no, you can kill that. Okay. It, it just blowed. I, I didn't do nothing. Titanium. I shot it. You shot it. Yeah, I didn't realize you could destroy that. So, hey, you found something that I didn't know could be destroyed. <laughs> oh, red rocks oh yes 
if you see these little red uh, rocks or if you see these little red almost mechanical looking things blow them up they will give loot okay, everything anything that's not a rock we can blow and have loot yeah and pretty the, much and the, the, the yellow rocks too. I don't think this one gave a whole bunch of loot. And the loot appears for everybody, even if you didn't be the collect it. Everyone gets the loot. That's, cool. That's how railjack missions work. That's really cool. Now, except for, except for certain things. Okay. And those certain things are mostly in Vale Proxima. We aren't going there tonight, obviously. That's way too big. Especially for this railjack here. This little puppy... Has to get nice and upgraded. Yeah. Nice and upgraded. There's no, uh, there's no black holes you can shoot at them. No, no black holes. That's a rare mod, but we'll get into that later. A rare avionic, I should say. Rich boys now, proud. also, if you look around as you're flying through space, if you see what looks like a distortion, it'll be like a little round circular distortion in space, like this one right over here. I'm going to ping the area, uh, if I can. There we go. So, you'll see this, like, distortion. Even once this thing inside the distortion is gone, it will still be here. I want you to see this distortion so you know what I'm talking about. Yeah, but I'm yeah, there's a lot more here. Off. Yeah, don't worry, I'm waiting. I ain't going nowhere. Are we really far from our ship? Don't we cannot... Oh, okay. This kind of thing. Now, yes, we are far from the ship, but it doesn't matter. We'll make our way back to it. Don't have um, any enemies fighting us. Enemies fighting us? Yeah, because we kill everybody. We are. Yeah, sure. we've already killed everybody. Okay. The only sh enemies we might find are. Oh. There we go. It. You want to shoot it? There's no stones. Yeah. Welcome, boys. I'm out here deep in the space. Yeah. Now you see that distortion right there, though, right? That distortion in space. Yeah. Those always have loot, but it's only one-time looting, so it doesn't respawn, obviously. But when you see those, you know, unless someone of your team has been there, there's going to be loot. Floating around in it, and then you can destroy that thing for more loot. Uh oh. What? The ambulance is on its way. How is that? This thing killed me. Yeah, but it's on straight. What is that? This thing can't blow up, I don't think. Yeah, but if you go to that, you know, you go inside and you die. Oh. Enter it. You, oh! You probably ran into it too hard. You can take collision damage. Oh, okay. Second. Yeah, I, I I should have mentioned that. You the, the railjack can also take collision damage. That's why you want to be careful when flying it through tight spaces. Now, some railjack builds. I will bring this up. Thrive on, like mine, my personal railjack thrives when it doesn't have any shield. Because my railjack has a special augmented piece of gear on it that when you're out of shield, it does more damage. There are, you'll find there's all kinds of things like that throughout this. They have all sorts of little funny passes.
And this is the best way to help new Railjack pilots get started. And that is after the mission is done, take a moment to just go around and pick the place clean. Because you, you, it's like how you do it in the beginning when you're uh -huh. starting out in normal Warframe 2 and not Imperian mode, I guess. Yeah, well, Imperian it's a little bit rough because all the things have a, a very high resource cost. And if you want to get anything uh, speedily, you're going to want either spam missions, which isn't as super conducive, because you have to spend resources constantly refreshing the ammunition in that, the, the payload, basically. So what you need to do to offset that in the early uh, in Railjack is to, at the end of these Earth missions, if your team is up for it, because they won't always be up for it, but if they're up for it, you need to come around and loot as much as you can after the, after the mission. Oh, also, another thing to note. Uh, I'm going to head back to the ship real quick because i got to watch the, the, the forge. But keep picking the place clean. Yes, in battle... Uh, I'm going to show you that. Yeah, okay. Come to the ship. Yeah, I have an end strength that allows me to just teleport back there. No way. And then, yes. But you win that. I, I teleported all the way back to the ship. I'm inside. But you win that? Or you, uh, uh, you, you, you? I used my Omni tool to teleport back because I have an in strength that I'm there. After we get it back to the dry dock, you're all going to have in strength points since we completed this mission, and I'm going to show you how to spend those. Yes, and in string points are a massive thing. Oh, I should also pick a, take the moment to note that all in string points we gain right now will be refunded when the captaining or captain or commandeer or whatever the hell they call it, it trait comes out. All of them will be refunded to be respent wherever we choose because they're coming out with a another part of the instinct that we can see but we can't access because it isn't complete. Brother, so, it's 8 kilometers, man. It's like, I don't know don't how, worry. how many miles, man. <laughs> don't worry. Oh, also, double tap shift while you're flying. Double tap? Oh. Yeah. That's a blink. That's cool. Yeah. And you can do it every time. Uh, the, you'll notice when you blink, there's these like little bars on the side of your po cursor or pointer or whatever you want to call it that fill up. Every time they fill up, you can blink again. That's your cooldown meter. Just double tap shift to blink. That's how you get through a little bit more speedily. That's an arch wing control. They changed that. Archwings can now all blink. It used to be just the Itzel that could blink. Uh, we just the Archwing stuff, so. So, No, don't okay, worry. Okay. I... My ship, please. Okay. okay. Now, down at the bottom, you'll notice there are the... Yeah. Oh, and you entered the right spot. Okay, so you'll notice we're at the back of the ship, okay? Yeah. Down here is the Battle Forge. This is where you can construct things during the fight. If we're like, let's say we're low on Revolite during the fight. You would construct Revolite here, like I did just now. I'm using the materials, and it puts, as you'll see, it puts the forge on cooldown for two minutes. A little over two minutes. And there's four of them here. So what, I, so what I'm going to do here real quick... For you, as I'm, yeah. Do go ahead and do one right there. And what I do? Revolite, flux energy, munitions. What I do? Nothing. I would have you make revolite. Revolite. Yes, we're gonna fill this ship up if we can before we leave. Okay, I did revolite. Fifty more. Okay. Yep, but all of the, but now the forges are on cooldown, so I will man the forges for now. But, but now, please, yeah. please say, 
so I can see, okay? So I can yep. show people at home how to do it. Okay. Now, you, I'm going to also point out, this is one of the exits to the ward, or the rail jack. Yeah. And then if you follow me, there are three or three more. Up here, this is the one I showed you before. And then back this way in this room, inside of here where the, um, I forget what the hell that means. The reliquary drivers are located right over here on either side is an exit. And you know what this is? Now this is um, one of the things that helps power the ship. This is the reliquary drive. This is what you had. There's a giant finger in there, yes. Imagine it. That I don't know. You also. Okay, we don't know yet. We, yeah, we do not know yet why there is a giant finger that appears in there. <laughs> as far as I'm concerned, it's a creepy pasta in the making. Yeah, I think so too. Okay. Now, there's so what? More exits over here. Yeah. Uh, no. Yeah. There's uh, also all these um, as you can see where the where the enemies entered. Yeah. That stuff will go away once we get gone. And what's this, my friend? Oh, what is? Oh, that? That is nothing. That's nothing. Okay. Uh, That's currently that is nothing. Yeah, most of the ship has no purpose as of yet. Yeah. As of yet. But you can exit here too. Oh. Okay. The ones that have purpose are the exits I showed you, okay. the two side turrets. The driver's turret and controls, and then this arc wing launcher right here, the the slingshot. That's how you do, use it. Yeah. Okay, yeah, yeah. So you're gonna come here. You're gonna uh, enter oh. it. Oh, here, over here. Okay. Yeah, hit, hit X. Okay. And I'm gonna teach you how to use it. Uh, I cannot X. I have to have a rank three gunnery master. Oh, okay, you don't have... Okay, we'll, we'll, we'll get to that afterward, then. And what's this? This is your That's engine. Size. Oh, I thought... No, this is your engine. If you want to stay fit, you come here. It's like a hamster wheel, yeah. No, it's... A, but, well, it's a hamster wheel for the ship, I guess. It's, okay. uh, it's the engine. Okay. The reactor. Okay, it so keeps the ship okay. going. So what we're gonna do now? We're gonna uh, come back to the dojo or just do the next mission? We're gonna we're gonna go back to the dojo because I got some things to explain. But first, okay. we're gonna okay. see if we can fill this uh, puppy up on its on its munition needs before so, we enter. That way, I go outside again and loot. Yeah. Yep. That's my job. Okay. I'm going as of the friend. moment. Yeah. And then after we get done with the mission, I'm gonna refine the re what is left, and everyone's gonna get a, uh, gonna get those resources. And since I have a refining bonus, you're gonna get more than you normally would. Oh, that's, cool. that's a that's an instinct bonus. You want people with good refining to be the ones refining. We're almost done. Uh, if you can find anything else, just keep it coming. All I have to do is... All, everything is looted. No, never. Enough. You'll know when you... When it starts slowing down on finding stuff, yeah. you'll know that you're close to being done. And you don't have to loot everything. You just have to loot most of it. Most of what you can find pretty easily. I'm going to go ahead and refine this because you're finding a lot of resources still. I want us to get put some good loot still. Dude, I've been going so ham on this, dude. Like, constant. Yeah, yeah you're constantly finding stuff. That's how these low-level ones work. You'll see that we're getting lots of goodness. And, and Keep I see, okay, like, on, on, my, on my person, I'm really far out. 
a dense field of resources. I've filled up munitions, I've filled up dome charges, and i filled up Revolite, but because I had to refine because we were wasting resources, I cannot fill the flex energy yet unless we find some copper nicks and some more cubic diodes, but that isn't an emergency. We won't have any use for that yet. What do you mean we need more cubic diodes, dude? We've probably got like 400 of those bad boys. Uh, I know, and I refined it, so it goes into your... Per when I ref when you refine stuff in the forge, it goes into each player's personal inventory at that they'll get as loot after the mission. So you guys are all going to get a nice payday. And next On top of... Here again. Or maybe in the weekend. See, we got more QB dots, but now we need copper next, too. I'm just uh, near Titanium. Let's see if I can. Tenno, disembarking. I'm gonna take I'm a look around. I'm in the Titanium land. Ooh. Here's some more Titanium. Oh, damn. I found a piece of loot that was floating here. Oh, and what's Anode this cell. cell? What's this symbols? That is, a, that's another, that's another avionic. Okay. All of the things that appear that look kind of like that are avionic. Okay. So, I get to my ship, and um, Oneonta gets for his ship, and Bossman gets for his ship. Is that it? He can use everything that he can get here in his own ship. Er all yeah, all of the stuff that we acquire here, everyone gets a copy of it. That's really cool. But when it, I like this one from you. Yeah, it's really good. The the yeah. the only things that every that aren't shared loot for the most part like are things that you won't see for a good while. Okay. But they're things like the Shadu receiver. You have to actually be in the sentient anomaly inside the building and loot it yourself in order to get it. But that is something you won't worry about for a long while because you have to get an end strength, which we're going to wor worry about after the mission's over. Uh, you have to get one of those to level 7 to even go into the area where it's at. Yeah, okay. I'm not even going to use the thing, so. <laughs> Precisely. Maybe next episode, so, if you help us. Maybe next episode. Yeah. We're going to start a new episode series called The Well Tech or something. Well, I'm almost finishing the city, I'm almost here, so. Let's see, do we have any copper necks? Titan yes, we do! I'm the king of Titan. I only find Titan. I know. Excellent! Thank you guys! We are now filled completely on all payload slots. I'm refining what's still in here again. Because there's nothing to be made. Uh, so when you guys... When you guys are ready, come back to the ship, and I'll take us to the dry dock. Uh, I'm going to stay right here and just in case anything else pops up. When you're all in the ship, let me know. Just in case you guys find anything else that appears in the forge, because there's only four things that will appear in the forge. You notice how you're getting titanium? That is not something that will appear in the forge, but it is still important for you. The forge will only hold carbides, copper neck, cubic diodes, and pustrels. Every time you find those, it goes straight into the forge during the mission. The forge will only hold 200 units of any of these. So if you find, let's say, 201, that one gets wasted. 
So that's why mo monitoring the forge is a big deal. That's also another thing, like when you're in battle, as you repair stuff, you'll use the Revelite, so you'll come down here and make more of it during the mission so that you can keep afloat. Go ahead and find me. But yes, very good, guys. You did very good on the looting. I am very pleased to announce that this ship is now fully stocked for its munition payload. Cool. Can we use missiles and stuff like that? Yes. Yeah. Thank you, man. And boss and honor. No worries, Rob. Yeah. And you're all going to get a nice payload after the mission because also I would like to point out that end of mission award goes to everybody as well. So we also got, if you hit P really quick, you'll see you've got a thousand pustules and 750 copper nicks and a hundred Dirac on top of the stuff we've also got. We got a lot of stuff, man. Yes, P5 and that'll come in handy. Conic nozzle, bottle forge. You have to teach me yep. all this, man. I don't understand. Oh my god. Thank you. If y'all wanted, I could take you on a upgraded railjack to kind of show you how an upgraded railjack operates a little bit. It won't have any fancy powers, but I can show you the different guns okay. that you can have on it. We do it. We do it. So I'm here in the ship. Let's see. I count one, two, three heads besides myself. Let me double check the forge. I can pilot to the phone. And then, if you, okay, it looks like the forge is clean as clean gets. If you would, send us to the dry dock, Mr. Lobo. We are on it. And then I'm going to instruct you guys on how to start applying your instincts. From little Another things, job well big executed. things grow, cool. dreams. I have four points now. I believe in you all. You, it was really yes, fun. that's... I yes, four it. points is still enough to get you two things in the beginning. Okay. Oh, okay. Four points of intrinsics. What is this, this intrinsics? It's how you rank Yeah, interesting. Yes, that intrinsics is kind of like... Uh, hold on, let me think here. How do I describe that? Intrinsics is kind of like... A leveling system. Okay, so really quick, I want you all to hit escape. So in navigation now I have a lot of stuff. I have uh, Sover Strat, so I have another little three missions new, yeah? Three new missions. Sover Strat, Ryan Belt, and Fangul Satellites. Okay. And this one is done, okay. So you want me to exit? I want you to hit escape. Escape. All, all of you, now you, you'll put your mouse on your portrait. You'll see where it says show profile. Yeah. Click that. Yeah. Uh, wait, hold on. Why is that not working? I don't Maybe it has to be done from within your ship. Not like, not this ship, but, uh, in your side. within your, within your, your orbiter. Okay. So I, I, I do think we should all go to our orbiters really quick. Because this is an important thing. So everyone leave Dojo real quick. Now you should all have around four interesting points, right? Yeah, I ended up with three. You ended up with three? That's... You got what? You got to seven? Okay. Probably have a little bit of an affinity booster. In, uh... I actually don't have anything. Okay, so what you're going to do is hit escape. You're going to go to your profile. Mm -hmm. You'll see a thing called interesting. Manage your interesting skills. No. 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 Do we have to create our own ship first. 
Mmm, shouldn't. Yeah, but maybe you I do. I have my ship, but I don't have it too. I only have equipment, stats, syndicates, and challenges. I'm gonna enter my current clan dojo and go to my dry dock and see if I could do that. Uh, okay. like you got you gotta hit escape and you see where it says on your orbiter. You're in your orbiter, right? Yeah. You'll see it says navigation, equipment, operator, market, communications, quests, board railjack, profile. Yeah. You'll click profile. Oh, that profile, okay. Yeah. And then my profile. Then you'll see... Uh, yeah. Then you'll see interesting sound there. I don't know. Oh, I and see then you'll... Sound. Yep. And then you'll see that now. I want to like take a moment to point out. You'll see at the very far right end. You'll see there's an area called oh, Command, but it's grayed oh, out. Yeah. That's the one I was talking about. It's here, but it's not here. Okay. So now I'm going to teach you how to see what each of these does. So if you put your mouse on one and right click, you can see what rank one does, what rank two does. Oh, Yada. Next rank one. Next rank two. And that's all. Next rank two. You people are. You can do it. So what you do is you once you've right clicked and you decide which one you want to rank up first. The balance oh, of power continues it, to shift. I put two Navigation is marked one with piloting. new invasions. On piloting. One and two on tactic tactical. Oh, okay. You put two on tactical and one on piloting. Yeah. Okay, that works. But I would, uh, I would recommend putting the re your future points okay. on engineering and gunnery. Okay. And here's why: engineering is for definitely useful for operating the forge, for repairing the ship. Okay. And for um, and for making your uh your Archwing tanky. If you look at all four of them, if you right click all four of them and look at their rank eight skill, mm -hmm. I would like to point this out because this is an important thing. All those rank eight skills affect your archwing, and those do not just stay in the railjack missions. That's everywhere. And for two nine and C two zero. Aeronaut will give your archwing a permanent twenty percent increase to speed. From piloting, uh, our, uh, you can reduce the blink cooldown by 25% with tactical. With gunnery, you can increase your archwing's power. It'll give it a 25% damage, 20% ability strength, 20% ability range, and 20% ability efficiency increase. Okay. And you'll and engineering will give you more tank, 30% more shield, health, and armor. That's cool. That's cool. So the first yes. thing that we have to do. It's the engineering and, and gunnery. Yes. So you, Engin you engineering and gunnery are two of I don't two of the most important. They, they are seeing on profile yet. Are you seeing? I would like to also point out the rank four of tactical is also uh, very important because that's how I teleported to the ship. Oh, that's really cool. See, it says Omni Gear can be used to warp aboard the ship from anywhere. Yeah. In a mission, if you, if the, let's say the ship is suffering from a bleed out, and there's no one on the ship, what you would do is you would go to like you're going to equip the Omni tool, and it will teleport you back to the ship, so you can then go about That's fixing it. that. Yeah. 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 Cool. And you can do that from anywhere in the mission. All of these interestings are very valuable, but at the same time, I would like to point out, which you might have noticed already, whenever you put a point in, the next one costs twice as much. Oh, I didn't see so, that. Yes. So, yeah, let's... Rank two costs the, two points. the rank six interesting costs 64 interesting points. The rank seven one costs 128. The rank nine costs 356 I think or and then the last or, or something like that and then the rank 10 is going to cost the most period 
And each one of these is individual. So you'll have to pay these interesting points I'm pointing out for each tree. So this is a lot of a grind for experience. So uh, it will take a little while to build it up. To max up, yeah. Yes. You, you can do it on boss and on another. You did it? Your interest I, 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 My interestings are 7, 7, 8, 8. Okay. So you have two to go? Almost. I have two to go in gunnery, two to go in engineering, and three to go in tactical and piloting. Cool. But it has taken a lot of railjackery okay. <laughs> to get that far. I have literally done every mission at least once that's currently available to railjack pilots. And on top of that, I have been grinding Saturn, but mainly Vale Proxima, for more, uh, for better gear, for better avionics. And I would like to also point out those avionics we got, they come in tiers. Be and by tiers, I mean there's they're, they're made by different houses. Like, there can be two of the same mod, but they're made by different houses. And so they are different levels of quality of effectiveness. Okay. For, exa for example, let's say you had two Polar Coil mods. One from House Slavon, one from House Zekti. The Zekti one will probably operate a little better because that's what they've needed. They needed the polar coil to make their weapons better because their weapons overheat the most but do the most damage. They they focused on raw firepower at the expense of higher overheating costs. Each and every piece of gear, each and every piece of avionics you get from a mission is going to have different statistics probably. And some of these things won't have a different statistic. Some of these are a rare drop. I'm going to give you an example. There are certain avionics you might come across called um, Void Hole, for example. This is a rare combat battle mod. It makes a black hole in space. It's an extreme... This is for everyone to know. Railjack can be a lucrative, lucrative. If you don't plan on using that skill for whatever reason, you can sell it... Like, I've sold a spare I had for, uh, since it's currently early, I sold it for about 450 platinum. Oh, that's cool. That's nice. Yes. That's really cool. And, but that drops only from Vale Proxima, like I mentioned. Each and everything has specific places you can so find it, or certain things that'll drop it. Now, you've had a taste of Earth Proxima. Now, it only gets more difficult going forward. Now, let's do one more. And we cover today. And okay. then you, you, you show us how you are. Well, Jack, and then we cover today. Okay. If everybody's agreeing, of course. I will show you guys yeah. my rail, Jack. Okay. Uh, now, to do that, I'm going to have to be the one that invites people, to, though. Oh, Let's do one more of mine. Okay, one more. Okay. 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 Let's see here. Uh, which way? Are they? Oh yeah, here we go. Dry dock. <coughs> it's all the the dungeons are the same. I'm inside the ship. Okay, really quick. It's the same uh, you should pop. Uh, really quick, pop out of your ship. Of the ship, the rail jack ship. Yep, and I want you to check the payload to make sure it's maxed out. Okay. It should be, but I want to make sure it is. Okay. Okay, there you are. Oh, no, that ain't you. No, no, no. There you are. Um, in this one? Research? Yep, Yo, go, this one right here that I'm standing on. No, the other one. You'll check it. You'll go to the fourth tab. It's the payload. Does everything say it's maxed? 300, 350, 12, 12, 4, 4. Yeah, everything is good. Good. Okay, let's go ahead and get on board. So, before I start, I always have to do this. 
come here and see. Before you, before you start a mission, you always want to double check your payload and make sure that you've got maxed out. Because it's going to be needed. My, my dog is going to come too. Is everyone on board? I'm not. Okay. Okay, I will take us out. On board, Captain. I'm going to take us to Silver Strait. It's the, the other one, the second one, right? Yep. Now, the first early missions are going to be relatively similar. We should only have to kill 20 to 30 fighters okay. and 2 to 4 cruise ships. Okay, but now let me see how you kill the pushers, okay? I go with you. Yep. You, you got so to I... handle piloting and fixing the ship? I can pilot, I can, I can fix, but I don't really know how to fix, I don't have an Omni tool. Quite. Oh yeah, you do, everyone gets an Omni tool. To access it, hold down Q, you'll see it, it looks like a little white device. Oh, there we go. Yeah, yeah. Okay, so there's no cruise ship out right now, but I'm going to show you how you can kill it both two ways. Okay. There, there's two ways to kill it. You can kill it from within inside the ship, only if you have the four of four dome charges that I had you see there. Th you didn't have those before until I made them. Now, you can't do that unless you have level five gunnery, too, I must point out. You need level five gunnery instinct to use what I'm going to show you. But it's going to be flashy. The audience should love flashy. Both have, I like this. Yep. I'm just sitting here. Really. I got that 360 gunner mode, hell yeah. Yep, 360 degree gunnery takes away the ship so you can see all the way through it. Crucial reinforcement has arrived. That's a super important one for gun side turret. Welcome visitors inbound. Okay, to so I want you to take the wheel for me, uh, Lobo, and aim at that cruise ship down there. It's that big ship. Just aim at it. Just keep it in front of you. Right, I'm fixing ship. Yep. Yeah. How, how do I, how do I stop yeah. that? Get ready and watch and behold. See it? Yeah. No, 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 it's already dead. If you look directly behind the pilot seat, uh, no, you can get off the wheel. Yeah. I'm going to show you this. Um, at level 5 gunnery, there is a special machine you can use right here. This uh, is the forward artillery. Okay. It, can, it needs a clear line of fire to shoot, but it is extremely effective. It will... Like it's it, yeah, it's like a giant laser. It's a, no, it's a giant beam. Boom! It cuts through space. It will not go through asteroids though. But have a. That's why I said you need a. Time or how it is. It requires dome charges to, to use, and it does a lot of damage. Oh, we needed to be repaired. I guess I, I wasn't watching that. My bad. I don't know what Try happened either. It. I don't know what the fuck I'm doing with the Omni tool. It's just it's like yeah, charging up or something. Yeah. There's two of us that look like we were repairing it, but I don't think it worked. Yeah, no, 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 no. Oh, like, okay. Doo -doo 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 -doo. I'm gonna... In yeah, I see what happened. Okay. So when it comes to repairing the holes in the side of the wall, you'll hold down left click, and yeah. you'll drag your mouse back and forth across the fissure, and that'll seal it. It's like you're applying tape over it, or sealant, okay. in this case. So you gotta like weld it shut. Yeah, weld it shut. You gotta move your mouse over it, or your cursor, like your aimer. Lazy weld. So I'm gonna take us back out there real let quick. Me, let me, let me, oh, okay. Let me choose so people can see it. Now. So it's the okay. Sil yep. Sil Silver straight. Silver straight. Okay. Yep. And we have to see this. Okay. Nope. But we did one. No. Okay. 
I'm gonna let you shoot this thing. <laughs> yep. So what's gonna happen is I'll take out the first early ships, and whenever the cruise ship appears again, you'll take the wheel. You gotta just keep the thing in front of the ship, and I will destroy it. All right, I got the. I'll just stay off of a turret so I can really just be on breaches and whatever. Ladies and gentlemen that, uh, that are viewing this, remember this: Railjack is a team effort. It takes every member of the crew to make sure that the the mission succeeds. Thank God, some team work in this hole. I'm really happy for you. Now, where the heck do you think you're going? No, you ain't going nowhere. Okay, here we go. I'm chewing. Yeah. Reading large translation signature. Okay, Lobo, come up here. Okay. You're going to take the wheel, and you're going to see this star symbol over there, star diamond. You're going to head toward it a little bit, and you're going to keep it in front of you. That's the cruise ship. Which one? The, new one. It, the, the, the one that looks kind of like a star. You'll see that there are little diamond triangle things, the red diamond triangle things, and then there's a red star looking one. That, they just head toward it. I'll tell you when to stop. I got it. Okay, Sorry. good. Okay, stop and just watch the magic happen. Our invaders possess more enthusiasm than talent. See? This is that car. You saw it stop and mi just stop and it blow up. I can't see anything on my mini map. Hold up. What you need to do is hit M, that'll make the big map appear. You'll see that there is this... I mean, uh, Nothing's loading for the mini map. For, I'm really lagging. I can't walk through doors without it like uh, stopping. It's okay, I got, the, I got the repair. I got it. I saved us. It's like uh, I got off the turret, and uh, I'm still on the turret, kind of. Can you pilot? I can do that. Yeah, yeah. I'm just gonna pilot us. Fire aye, aye Captain. Resolved. Pilot us to victory! Okay, Oni. Can defend us. Can defend the ship. Yep, yes. we can defend the ship. And now, I'll take this, uh, the, the turret over here real quick. Then now, when the next cruise ship appears, Oni, I'm going to instruct you on what to do. The same thing that I did with Lobo. Yeah. Alright, I'm lining it up with the cruise ship then, or are we taking care of fighters first? We're going to line it up with the cruise ship when it appears. It's not here right now. Oh, never mind, it is here. Where's it, it is, at? It is, it is. Oh, I see it. Okay, get me in front of that cruise ship. Like, get it in a clear line of sight. It can't be behind, uh... Alright, we got a hole rupture. Yeah, yep, it's... So, Lobo, you just repair the ship real quick. We're lined up with the cruise ship. I, I gotta yep. move, though. I gotta... No, I'm gonna take... Don't worry, just hold still for a second. No, 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 just... No, 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 just hold still. Hold still. And face it. We can handle us a little bit of damage. It's at 200 health. Don't worry. Health. It can't drop below a certain point. Hold still. Compression levels stabilizing. There. It's blowing up. Okay. The thing about Railjacks is no matter how low their health drops, they cannot fully be destroyed. And once we repair this thing here, you'll see we're going to heal up a whole bunch. Uh, here. Let me help you with that. Uh, see? Notice how we went in gray health and shield? We're invincible for a moment. Yep. Okay, if there's another cruise ship, do the same thing we just did. We want to get rid of the cruise ships first. Oh, let's go to one. So you can see. 
Can we get in? Yes, we'd have to exit the rail jack. Yeah, yeah, let's do that. Uh, uh, okay. It, it, is it not a cruise ship? No, it was, it's like a cannon battery, but it had a specific emblem on it. Oh, okay. Yeah, there won't be any more cruise ships in this mission. There shouldn't be. We already took care of the two that will spawn, so now we gotta kill three fighters and then it'll be looting time again, boys. Just kill three fighters. The ship's in good health. Yeah, in in yeah, and the next one will show you how to manually go in a cruise ship if you can't use the dome charge. Fighters incoming. Keep them off the ship. In the meantime, I'm gonna quickly refill with the forge. Refill what we need because I can do it without wasting too many resources. I have better forge capacity. Uh, uh, let's see here. Enemy morale has broken. Perfect. Oh, look at that! Vidar engines, Mark One. Seven hundred and fifty carbides and a thousand copper. Time to break some rocks. Yep. Go ahead and head out, boys, and I'll monitor the forge. Go about uh, looting. Now, you'll so you saw in this mission, there was actually turrets on the asteroids. There wasn't for on the first mission. Now, they will be out there, and they will shoot you. So, if, they, if you see them, kill right. them. Kill them, and they will drop more loot. They can drop... Uh, loot just like any other thing. I'll go ahead and refine real quick. So in all the flights we have to go to that force and see? Uh, say that again? In all fights, in all missions, we have to go to that forge and always stay with that forge, yeah? Yeah, at the end of the mission, you always want to make... This is a key rule, no matter which level of difficulty you're on, at the end of the mission, make sure you refine everything that doesn't get used during the mission. You want to pay your crew. Because you're not always going to be around people that you know. Sometimes you have to enter into a, a random crew, and you and you want to make sure that they're re rewarded for their effort. After all, if it doesn't get used, it's just going to get wasted. You know, it, the stuff in the forge doesn't get kept if it isn't refined. And the forge is now full again. I have crafted everything. We are maxed out on munitions. I am going to just refine everything we get from here on out. So everyone's getting everything else now. I will be right back momentarily. I need a soda pop. So just go about your looting. I'm going to refine one more time so it's at zero across the board. So that it won't overflow by the time I get back.
I am back. Welcome back. Welcome. Oh, and I would like to also state, uh, I thought, uh, men thought I'd mention this, but I thought about it while I was gone getting a drink. Any affinity boosters or resource boosters you have will apply to the resources earned inside Railjack Mission. And that also includes refining resources. And the affinity booster will count toward your end strings. And I would like to also point out repairing the ship is one of the easiest ways to earn in strength experience. So it always hurt, doesn't hurt to take turns in doing so. We're gonna have a decent haul here, boys. looking at what we've got and I've been refining I do I try to prevent it from reaching 200 because otherwise it might waste resources we also got a particle ram which is a very useful ability that is one of the uh, one of the avionics we picked up a particle ram Well, that's going to be a good one. Ooh, testers. Yep. Once you guys feel that you have picked the field clean, go ahead and come back. But don't do it if you don't think you've picked it enough clean that, to your liking. Once you're all done looting, let me know. I'll refine, or make sure we're refined, and then we'll take her back to the dojo. The mission has been, hey, we win. So this is all just for the benefit of upgrading rail jacks. You need all of the resources we're getting here to upgrade. Would it be quicker to fly the ships about like halfway along the stage than us flying? I mean, it's halfway top thing. True, I could do that. I'll go ahead and move it a little bit out there. That way you guys don't have to fly it so far. Because yeah, it just seems we sort of seem to have parked at one end of the thing. Yep. I, I'm i glad you mentioned that. So, hold up.
How's this looking for you? <laughs> nice. There we go. That should be plenty much closer. So what did he say about the cloudy areas? Look inside near those and inside those you can look for those gravity distortion fields that I was mentioning the ones that look like distorted space you can find them outside of them but it's much easier to like just start looking near though for the for the loot spots so how can I see which rank I am uh, you mean with instrink you uh you do that after the mission. Yeah. You can't do that. Uh, you can't do that during the mission. Okay. I'm back on the forge, monitoring it. So I do have a question, with these lower level ones, do you have to have four people, or can you go in with, say, two or three? Um, that is a good question. These lower level ones are actually fairly easy to do. You could probably manage a Railjack mission with two, two people at a lower level. One person just has to take care of the ship, and one person has to make sure that the cruise ships go down, and then focus on the rest of them. The cruise ships have to take priority because they're going to because the cruise ships will send out ram sleds which are going to be boarding party. You can shoot them down before they get to the ship, but it's not so easy. That takes practice. So one person has to be on the cruise ships until they're gone. Once that's gone, the rest of the mission is pretty straightforward at these low-level ones. It's just straight up clean up the fighting parties, the fighters, at that point. All the, all the missions are like this, just killing uh, ships and ships and ships, or...? Yeah. No. Okay. There will be, um, missions where you'll have to, let's say, disable a pulse turbine. Okay. Whatever and whatever. you'll have to actually go inside of that, and that's going to require parties to be on the outside and the inside. Okay. They get, they get much more complicated than this. That is for certain. You will, as you get further and further into the Railjack uh, battlegrounds, you will see this. Whether it's a ship killer platform, a pulse turbine, a, a sentient anomaly, it all gets more complicated. There's also... Certain times you'll find an assassination target within the mission, and those targets can drop special blueprints. For the Quellor and the Pennant, those are tradable blueprints, but you will probably want them for yourself. The Pennant is a, is a uh, two-handed Nikana, it's a sword, yeah. and the Quellor is a rifle. Those are both acquired within Railjack missions, just like the Shadu pieces are required acquired from sentient anomalies in Bale Proxima. There are plenty of goodies to be had in Railjack missions, but um, and, and, while not as many of them are for non-Railjack scenarios, they are still important. Because, after all, this is just the precursor. We are preparing to head into the new war 
which will be the war against the sentience restarted. Let's go, I'm ready. Yeah. I was watching a dev stream, that's why I'm back. It's gotta say it got me a bit excited. Mm-hmm. Now this ain't that ain't gonna be coming until later this twenty twenty, but I've got my I've got my my heart set on it. I'm waiting patiently. Well in, in the summer. Ah. Yep. Summer, summer, summer. summer That's my hope. They can, take you so long. they can take their time, I've got a lot of catching up to do. Uh, yep. The, the the finger is talking. Is this normal? The finger box? Uh, you mean cephalon side? I think so. The big finger. In the oh, the finger. Yeah. You might remember when sometimes when you go into your ship after you have completed the. Uh, uh, I'm trying to remember. Is it the War Within quest? You you might you might come across this shadow that looks like your operator that goes, yeah, yeah. "Hey, kiddo." Yeah. Well, that's his voice. He talks to you when you get near the reliquary drive. And also, if you hit, hit X on it, Cephalon Psy will make comments to you. So go ahead, feel free to talk to him a few times about it. I need my operator. If my operator here, then talk. You gotta be in your Warframe, probably. And... Okay. And he says different things. In the summer, we're going to know more about the finger. You guys are doing fantastic on the resource gathering. This is right down my alley for like, just shoot the thing, go to the thing, grab the thing. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> Rinse and repeat. Like I said, though, once you feel that you've gathered enough, just come on back to the ship, let me know when you're all on board, and then I'll make sure it's refined. And then right. we'll head back to the dry dog. We'll probably have to get you to fly out here again, you're um, nearly 17 k's away. Okay, I'll, get, I'll move us up forward. And when I say us, I mean me and Lobo in the ship. Because me and Lobo are on board. Towards Bossman, P, and I. Yep, that's what I'm doing. I now I should also point out, even though this ship isn't upgraded, it benefits from my piloting instincts. That's why it's able to jump forward like it's going to here in a minute when the boost runs out. I I've cleaned this area pretty well, other than a few rocks you'll find, but. Yeah, I haven't, I haven't picked anything up in a few minutes. You guys have been doing just fine. Yeah. Like I said, it doesn't have to be picked super clean, but it needs to be picked clean enough that we can feel we can walk away and say, "Hey, we got a great payload out of this mission. We're going to this will go toward our next upgrades or whatever." And now, while you two do not have rail jacks, you'll have these resources available to you later on. They will be stored away, waiting for your rail jack. That's why really cool. I'm putting in the effort. Yeah, that's really cool. So this is think of this as preemptive preparation.
I'm here with you. This is very helpful for them and you. I hope you're all learning a fair amount. Yeah. And for people at home too. Here we go. This should be close enough. I think we're about done. I reckon we got 90% of it. <laughs> right. Hey, that's right. what we want. That's what we want. We want that 90... 95% of it, whatever you think is good, and when you think it's good, just come back on board, let me know when you're both here, and I'll make sure it's all refined, and then Lobo can take us to the dojo. Also, I should feel that it's important to know, even if he clicks to go to the dojo now, it will not go until you get on board. Oh, that's cool. Okay, you guys are heading back. Everything is currently refined. Let me know when you're on board. Right, yeah, jumping through the wall now. It's a bit weird how it doesn't seem to have proper doors on the outside. Oh, don't, those are doors down there. Those are doors. Okay, it might just be lag. It seems to be I just teleport through the wall. It, they don't Whatever open wall. open. But they're, they are a door of sort. Okay, you're all on board, it looks like. Okay. Right on. Yay. Everything Send is refined, too. Okay. Here we go. Another job well executed. It was. She said so. Okay, we got a lot of good guys with us. Yep. Just a few diodes. Just a few diodes, listen to you. They're a bit stingy on the creds though, aren't they? Jeez. <laughs> 146. Well, you don't get credits unless it's from boarding parties for the most part. Until later on. Fair enough. Okay, so I have to quit this um, squad there? Yeah? Yep. Okay. If we're gonna use if we're gonna use mine, I'll have you'll have to quit squad and then I'll invite everybody. Well, okay. I gotta um, I gotta head off anyway, guys. But thank you oh. very much for the group. Yeah, no worries. We we'll see you. Thanks for hanging. Thank you for joining us. So no problem. It's very informative and um, very much pleasurable. And watch you in YouTube, bro. Watch yourself. Ah, uh, what's up? Yes. Watch yourself in YouTube. In a few minutes, okay? I'm gonna put it on YouTube. This is going live to Twitch, but then I have to put it on YouTube. Oh, we have Vidal Engines MK1. What's that? Now, that is a scrap uh, part that we found. If now you can if you can afford it, if you like the way it looks, like I'm gonna actually teach you how to look at that real quick. You have to go to your, the dojo and go to the dry dock. Uh, hold up, I'm going to the dojo right now. Okay, we're about to... I just got an ephemera, so I have like a path behind me. As the I cons... That's awesome. Uh-huh. You'll go to the console in the dry dock that you were using to make sure that the, the all the ammo is full.
Do you see where it says Sigma Engine Mark 1 on the first tab? Now, if you decide that you like that engine enough, you can you d put resources toward repairing it so you can put it on. I'm gonna wait for the tree. I'm almost getting the tree. Yeah. You want to use the threes yeah. for sure. Three of everything. Yeah. Almost there. No, no rush, no need for rush. We get that, we, we get that. So you wanna uh, so, show you... So, if you're not gonna build it, what you need to do is scrap it for Dirac. So what you'll do is you'll click on it, okay. and down there at the... Yeah, that's what I'm telling you. You gotta go to it, you gotta click on it. Inside that uh, page, like you're gonna equip it, you click on it. And then down in the bottom right, you'll see that there's repair. And then there's a scrapping button, and then there's a rush repair with a drone. You'll hit the scrapping button, and it'll turn it into Dirac. If the part was already made, which it isn't, but if it was already made, it wouldn't give you Dirac. It would give you resources that you use to make it. But where, where can I see that? In the um, no. Oh. You gotta go back into the other panel like you're going to equip the thing to your ship in the research no not in the research like railjack components it's the first of the six tabs okay components you'll, you'll see where it says sigma engine oh okay so i have repair or scrap 75 grab that Scrap that Vidar one, yep. Okay. Okay. So now I'm ready to... For your invitation. And now... I'm gonna invite you guys so you can... Watch your... Uh, a, a real, a serious rail jack. Yeah, now it's not perfect yet. It doesn't have any special powers yet. Yes, it does. Not yet. No, no, no. It, it's really tanky, though, and it does a lot of damage. Uh, Vio, where'd you go? Oh, wait. That's right. I don't have you added. Only... That's right. I was thinking he was on my friends list already. Mine's gonna look different. When you get to the dry dock, you'll see it. It's green. It's all green. The green and black. Are... It's have... sleek. It's got the sun oh, green it's skin. Two snakes. Okay, you're seeing that. On this. Permission to board granted. The workers are here before we leave the ship anyway. Oh yeah, that's right. Alright, now I'm gonna take us to Rian Belt. Now what? Uh I'm gonna take us to the next mission, the Rian Belt. Skip this cinematic. And now you'll notice uh, uh, the health of the ship is 6,060. So I put a lot of... I, and the shield's got 1,907. I've put a lot of my resources into making this thing tanky and hit hard. The turrets are also different. Operational capacity in this sector. Uh, Lobo, if you would, I want you to, to fire the driver's seat turret. 
Uh, so come up here. Yeah. yeah, that's an APOC still. So go ahead and get out of that. I want you to see the other turret. The one in the driver's seat over here. And you'll see it overheats really fast, so... Shots yep, four shots and it's overheated. But it hits really hard. In fact, why don't you take us up there and hit one and so you can see how hard it hits for yourself. Uh, look for something that's white or red and walk, go up to it and oh, shoot it. Yep, they'll turn red when you get close. Hey, Oni, let, let him hit one. Yes. See that? Now, these things are very, like you can see, it's going to cut through them like a hot knife through butter. Can't go for these ones. It would take them a lot to kill this ship. Um, it'll be in, as you're in the driver, or sorry. Can you, on the left hand side of your screen, do you see where we have fighters and cruise ships? Right above that, it'll show you the shield and uh, health of the ship. Or it should. Maybe. Do so I feel like I'm fucking Anakin Skywalker in some turret right now? Just like, got it! <laughs> got it on Zola! And if your weapon freezes them? Yep. If the, it freezes them, so if, they, if it doesn't kill them in one hit, they get frozen. At higher level missions, it takes more than one hit to freeze them, but... The missiles just take care of the cruise ship. As you can see, an upgraded railjack has torn through this mission with relative ease. We've already got both the cruise ships dead. The other one just hasn't registered yet. And we're on the last four fighters. That is what your railjack will grow to be with the proper decision making on its mods, on its Weapons and armor. It just. This is just a taste of what is to come with your railjack. That's really cool. So that now we don't. What? Yep, we're not going to stick around to loot this one. This was just to show you guys. Okay. So, so I'll take us back. Oh, we have a new player. Yellows. Yep, they are uh, a random. Yeah, yeah, they come here. Here's our brother. So let's say goodbye all together. Goodbye, guys. Goodbye. Catch you later. Yeah. Goodbye. Let's watch out our channel, please. That's what really helps to build the plan. To be here another 100 years if we can. <coughs> You know what to do, please do this, please subscribe, and if you don't like our content, please set your enemies to subscribe, to we kick them over here. So, be really, really happy.
We die hard productions.